we've got more movement on the highly anticipated Green Lantern show, courtesy of the illustrious Illuminarity. Tobias Menzies is likely going to play Sinestro, a pivotal character in Green Lantern stories. Menzies was apparently on Game of Thrones, though I don't remember him on it, and it's strange too because I watch Game of Thrones, so oops. Now, you know, according to the Illuminati, Menzies is just in talks, so it has not been confirmed that he's going to get the role. But usually when people are saying somebody's in talks, they basically like, you know, clinch the role, um, pending, you know, some fine details, some fine print or something. But anyways, on this show, we're supposed to see Sinestro before he turns bad and joins the Yellow Lantern Corps. It'll be his earlier years when he was still a good guy and a Green Lantern. CBR has a detailed summary of the character's long and complicated history. Created by John Broom and Jill Kane, Sinestro debuted in 1961's Green Lantern No. 7 as the arch enemy of Green Lantern Hal Jordan. Over the years, however, more of his backstory has been revealed, including his time as one of the greatest Green Lanterns. He's even become an anti-hero in modern stories, so there's no telling where the character could go in the new series. Eventually, Sinestro becomes the founding member of the Yellow Lanterns, who use fear-based powers to battle the Green Lanterns and generally wreak havoc in the DC Universe. Sinestro's only live-action appearance to date was in 2011's Green Lantern, which saw Mark Strong play the heroic version of the character who trains Ryan Reynolds' as Hal Jordan. Now, the show is supposed to be filming right now already, and I'm excited about it. And I'm curious. If Sinestro's not going to be a villain on it, at least not for the first season or so, then who will the bad guys be? I guess the writers won't have too much of a problem coming up with some antagonists, since Green Lantern comics have had a lot of space bad guys in them over the decades. It'll probably be nice too, to see Sinestro's journey from good guy to bad guy play out over several episodes. That's not something we could see really play out as easily in a movie. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please like it on YouTube and subscribe to the channel because I appreciate your viewership, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.